how to earn money, which is helping people. And God's economy is all about specialization, <coughs> which is this. There's a reason why there's 12 tribes of, uh, in Israel. There's a reason. If you look at Deuteronomy 28, it, it starts from there. Deuteronomy 28 starts the blessing that Moses gives down to, uh, excuse me, Jacob gives down to his, his 12 sons. Now, think of it from a logical perspective. If God wants you to say, you know what? I want you all to be blessed, be favored, go march on. But that's not what the Bible says. The Bible says that in each one, he specifically gave each one an order. And that makes sense in business. And this is and, and it's going to start tying this all together, which is this. For an example, if I told you a, a Levite, what is a Levite to you? A priest. A priest, a law. If I said uh, the tribe of Issachar, what would, what you, would, what would you uh, subscribe them to? Like wisdom, yeah. uh, times and seasons, wisdom. Okay. Um, Judah, praise, music, art. So this is what God wanted to do. God always wanted to create a family. And within that family, he gave each one a specialization. So this is how, how you have to start looking at the economy like this. And it starts with Joseph when everyone bows down. So you have 12 tribes. Put that there. Each one has a specialization. Blacksmith, jewelers, uh, priests, scholars, uh, 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 fishermen. People uh, that each tribe has a specialization, and that's what it's a key. It's simple, but it's a key, which is there's no one man or one woman show. That's what you have to understand. In order to make money in any type of business, you need a team, and that's how God's economy works. You need a team. No way around it. If you try to do everything in your own business, you will fail. I can guarantee you, or you can only grow so much. In business, you need to de depend on other people. This is the, the, the biggest, one of the biggest obstacles I face in real estate, which is this. There's a lot of people that don't believe in team. They want to keep it all to themselves. Why? Because if you know what I got, oh, then I'm not making money. But I don't operate that way. I operate under the abundance mentality, which is, you know what, there's plenty of deals for you, plenty of deals for me, let's work with each other. And right, and I think we work with you, I've taught you like stuff that I do, I do in real estate, and I don't mind sharing that because if you know that doesn't threaten me, it actually empowers me. And when you start understanding that with whatever type of business that you're doing, whether real estate stocks, whether it's lawn care, whether it's whatever it is, you need a team. And that's the way you'll always, you'll always grow is when you have a team. If you're the smartest one in your group, I'm, I'm sorry to say, you're not going far in your business.